Last week you were talking with me in Dallas off record, man. You were mm-hmm. like, yo, I hate this industry. Right. A week later. You still hate this industry, man? Absolutely. Absolutely. And the reason I hate this industry is you got so many fake people. Right. Mm-hmm. So many people that talk tough on these ears and that, that rap so tough, but you never see them. Mm. So soft. And, right. and so many men do so many female things. Mm. You know, like um, my wife told me something. Like I used to get mad all the time. You know, somebody used to say something. It used to make me upset because I came from the... From the from the place where you know my pops is a cop and my right. pops was one of those dudes where he's the type of dude that be like oh he, if somebody say something he'll put his gun to the side let's let's shoot a fair one right. and that's what he taught me like you know if you talk tough let's fight let's right. let's shoot let's shoot the fade and then if, if I knock you out I'll pick you up and say you know what we're good, we're have good. a good day if yeah. you knock me out pick me up good but when I got in this industry it was all this fakeness mm. you know what I mean all this fakeness like um and when people get emotional. They don't know how to stay the coast. They get emotional and start going crazy. Yes. Mm-hmm. You know, like I had a, a one jock talk about my kids, right? Hold on for a second. Hold on for a second. We don't have to be clandestine. What do you mean? All right. We, we know who we're talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One jock talking about my kids, right? <laughs> and, um... <laughs> it, it, I see you what you just did. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. no. Go on, go on, go on. It's, it's irrelevant. <laughs> so, um... <laughs> talk about my kids, right? Which was a coward move. This is, mm. That's something cowards mm. do. Mm. You know, mm. something I don't respect. Mm. Right? Not a man. Mm-hmm. Half a bitch. Right. Mm. Um, but I, I'm, I'm a different guy, so I just, you know... It is what it is, all right? If that's what you gotta do, you gotta live with it. Right. And when it happened, I was upset. Mm-hmm. I mean, upset. I'm like, I, I'm gonna try to take this dude's head off, right? Mm. So, you know, th- and this is why I love my wife so much. So my wife tells me, my wife says, you know, you can go kill this dude, right? And, um, and then that's, and what happens? Exactly. Nothing. You go to jail. I lose you. Right. Mm-hmm. He we, said, but, we lose this. But he says, he, she goes, you know what? Let me kill him breathing. Mm. I said, what the fuck does that mean? I ain't, mm. I'm not here for no deep shit right now, nigga. I want revenge. <laughs> she said, let her kill right. him. Right. She said, she said, you, she goes, she goes, baby. Take a break. Mm. Mm. Let me kill him breathing. Mm. I said, what the fuck does that mean? So she goes, you got to go to Miami to do your show. Go get this money. Mm. Mm. All right. When I get back home, he ain't got his job no more. Mm. Mm. So she goes, she goes, what I tell you? I said, you say you're going to kill him breathing. She said, that's exactly what I did. Mm. She said, I took everything he wanted. I mm. took his power away. Mm. And how did she do and that? And put him in cuffs, too. I took, she, his pow- I took his power away. How, and not only that? did I take his power away, took his power away and it took his job. Mm. And it's successful. Mm. So, like, you know, you can hurt somebody right. and kill them and, and they die. But, but what does that that's, do? That's senseless. That's senseless. Right, 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 right. But now if I kill you, you can't breathe anymore. You know, you're, you're alive, but you're dead. Right. What you do doesn't matter anymore. Mm. What you say doesn't matter to nobody. Nobody hears you no more. Mm. Mm. But then not only that, that same seat that you sat in, I'm sitting in. Mm. Damn. Not only am I sitting in, I'm sitting in there and I got your check. Mm. Mm. <laughs> not only do I have your check. Yeah, I wish you could see Envy's eyes right now. <laughs> You're irrelevant. <laughs> Envy's scaring me right now. You're irrelevant. Mm. Doesn't matter no right. more. I'm going to tell you right now. So I, I believe they call that checkmate. Checkmate. So everything that you say, doesn't matter. Mm. What's going on with Flex, B? Right. Like, what is going on with that, man? I mean, well, let me let me ask you a question. Yes. Does does do men do that? Nah. Nah. Not, it, like, it, let me it, let me exactly. let me interrupt. I'm gonna tell you, you. what a man no, does. No, let me interrupt. Exactly. A man. Da- Dallas, a man hold up. cheats on his wife. Dallas, hold up. A man does not beat up women. Hold up, Dallas. Let me let me let me let me tell you. That's this. all I wanted to say. Mm-hmm. Worst points mm-hmm. of my marriage. Mm-hmm. I remember saying to myself, I would not wish this on my worst enemy. Right. Mm-hmm. I remember saying that. Right. Lowest points in my marriage. Right. I would never want my worst enemy to go through that. Right. So I can't understand someone laughing and just being so fucking like I don't understand. You never that. beat a women combat? See, but, no, no. That's why you don't understand. See, it. But see, but the thing is, is, is you know, you, you become a gossip girl. Right. Mm. You see what I'm saying? And when it comes to this, it's like we be real. You know what I mean? It's like there's certain things that men don't do. Yeah, mm. you don't. You know, you it's, don't. It's the, and men don't do that because right. I would never do that. And his excuse was, oh, you talked about my daughter. Your daughter. And you mm. know what? I absolutely did. You know what I said? I said in the paper report, you beat your wife in front of your daughter mm. and your daughter Damn. called 911, which was in the report. Right. Which was in the report. That's a fact check. Right, right. In, the, in the report, a fact check. Right. So if you want to say that I, I, I reported that, I reported that as a journalist that I am on the radio. Of course. Now, what you did was made up lies. Right. Because all that 90% of the shit that you said was lies. Mm. But it's all good. 
It's all good. You you had your fun. Okay, but you know what? It doesn't stop. It, it doesn't stop that. We're still the number one urban morning show in New York yes, City. Yes, congratulations. It still doesn't stop that. I'm still the nicest DJ out here when yes, it comes to those yes, streets. Yes, yes, yes. Mm. Those, it doesn't stop that. It, it doesn't stop the fact that I can still walk around by myself. Mm-hmm. Now, you see this this young man that I'm with? with yes. I don't know where he went. Kenny right there? Right. That's, your up, Kenny? That's, that's not my security. You know who that is? Oh, who's that? I'm going to blow him up for a second. What's up, Kenny? That's Pause. my minister's son. Okay. Right? Now, the minister, I'm, I'm a minister, you know, she was talking to me about, you know, what's going on in my life. I knew for sure Kenny had at least a knife with him. No, nah, nah, yeah. no knife for nothing. Hey. No knife for nothing. Hey, Kenny, you let me down, Kenny. No knife. But don't get it twisted. I box, so I ain't worried about it. All no right, knife. all right, all right. But no knife, though. But Kenny's mom was like, you know, so I, you know, we talk, we talk. So I'm like, yo, I'm like, how's everything with your family? She was like, you know, I'm having a problem with my son. My son can't find a job. He has no motivation. H- how old are you, Kenny? 22. 22. 22. Okay, right. So I said, you know what? Now, I don't know Kenny. Me and Kenny don't know each other. I said, you know what? I'm going to pick your son up and take him with me and show him what I do so he mm-hmm. can see what hard work does. Right. And Kenny just been rolling with me. He mm-hmm. just, he's been going with me to the clubs. You know, every once in a while we take a shot. Right. You know, we go. Did he pop a artists, yet? Yeah, nah, you know nah, what you got to do? You know what you got to do just for old time's sake? What's that? Make Kenny carry a crate of records. There ain't no more crates. <laughs> I know, I know. I know. <laughs> you you got everything on your laptop, but come on. Come on, Kenny. You can't let Kenny get off nah, that easy. No crates, Kenny, no, you got to carry a crate of records. You got to get dirty one But the thing is, you know, I try to motivate, like I'm trying to motivate Kenny so he can get his life together and be on a good road because if nobody, if Clue wasn't there to motivate me, I might have been a drug dealer right now. Be in jail, so you know that's why Kenny said I roll by myself, and, and that's the thing that I can do. Like I roll through New York City by myself. I'm out mm-hmm. every night. Mm-hmm. I feel comfortable in my space, and certain people don't. I think he's insecure. I think he's miserable. Right. But that's just who he is as a person. Right. I can't help that. I mean, he's just not comfortable in his own skin. Now, so that's the reason he does the things now, that he now, does. Wasn't but, you know there what a saying? point when y'all were cool though? We were never cool. Y'all were never cool. Never cool. Yo, we worked yo, at the same station, right. but we were never cool. So the, in a sense, was he kind of funny styles? And I mean, I'm not trying to gossip. Nah, just, nah, nah. I'm just trying to get to why. You know what it was? I. I've never, I went one way, he went another way. Right. Like, you know, when I worked at Hot, I didn't have any friends. Mm-hmm. I wasn't in no clique. Right. Mm. The only person that I ever spoke to up there was Mr. C. Me and Mr. Mm. C had a mm-hmm. had a cool relationship. But other mm-hmm. than that, I, you know, I, I don't need to be in That's nobody's peace. clique. That's right. peace I don't to need say to do that anything. Right I, don't, I don't need to do anything with anybody. You know right. I mean, I wasn't, I wasn't with a Desert Storm clique. I never had a Desert Storm chain. Clue signed me to do an album right. but I ran by myself you know what mm. I mean and everybody see I always went by myself I right. never got extorted nobody ever made me do anything and that's just how I did you right. know what I mean I guess he felt funny for certain ways maybe he felt I was on his on his heels or he couldn't understand the Ferrari the Bentleys the, the Range Rovers the Cribs the jewelry I don't know right. you know what I mean but I, I, I get out there and I hustle <laughs> 